Here we go. Actually, I've forgotten something I should have done straight away and have that in here like that and break this. Because down there is the Guardian. So let's see if we can kill the Guardian with the bow. Missed him because he moved. Um, have a quick look around. We've got our boots on, so we're reasonably safe from Guardians. Uh, let's go down here and see if we can get the Elder Guardian. Here he is. One shot, two shots, and then we should be able to get him with the axe. That's my health doing fine. Now I got him with the Captive Dreams axe, so that should. Oh, what happened there? Where's the sponge? And that's strange. There's an object dropped down here. No. Nope. Oh, there it is. Look. Oh. So the, the other two elder guardians are around about here. What's this say? I've got this. Water breathing. Yes, we know that. Speed. I've got speed. Night vision. Yes. Mining fatigue. Of course, we get mining fatigue because we're here. So what I could do now is to go and attack the other guardians, <laughs> elder guardians. Now, which side are they? They will be this way over here. So we could go down here and have a look. Um, make sure I've got the bow in my hand, which I haven't got in my hand actually. Where has it gone to? I think this place will do fine. So we should go this direction. There you go. Very handy having night vision. I can. There's a couple of guardians down there. Let's see if we can get rid of these guys. It takes two shots to get them, by the way. Oh, there's a few around here, aren't there? But I've got quick draw on this one, so it's. This is actually the treasure room, isn't it? And you'll see I've... Oh, didn't get that far that time. What's happened here? Why is it not working? Oh, lag. Oh, wow. <laughs> All right. No, you don't. Thank you. Right, that should be most of them out of here. Let's go through, through here so we can find the Elder Guardian. Oh, yes, there is Tail. Nope. Now, are they out? Oh, yes, of course. We have to go up and through this place, I think. No, no, with that. Of course, with this Neptune, this Neptunian armor is very much the very best thing for ocean monuments because you've got you got water breathing. So that wasn't very good. This one over here, ah, uh, maybe. What have we got here? Of course, you have to. It's a bit of an obstacle course to find you, to find them. And all of the armor is, is basically water, designed for water fighting, so it's perfect. Let's try this one. No, I think that. Oh, sponge room. Ha! Huh. Convenient. So we should be able to or excavate this. Does it need anything? No tool. That'll do. Well, I've got to make sure I've got enough space in my inventory. I have. Good. Let's just do an or excavate this. Ah, oh, yes, of course, it's going to take too long with that one. I could drink a bucket, bucket of milk and then or excavate it. Let's do that. Come on, come on, come on. Then, why have I got so slow? 
hopefully we can do it in the time before I get the next um, mining fatigue there we go so we've got all of that 29 that's not too bad is it obviously that was fairly easy painless for a change uh, back in the main room let's have a look down did we go down here yes we did well it's a bit tricky to find where they my way through this maze nope nothing here is there okay tell you what I'm going to explore this but I'm not going to spend all my time on camera doing this you can see how effective it is how easy it's to get around this place without any problem whatsoever even with the guardians in the way they haven't proven to be anywhere as near as difficult as it would be in normal so i'll see you in a short while well, i found i think one of the two rooms with the elder guardian in here look of course there's quite a lot of mobs around there's quite a few of these mobs around here what i'll do just so i've got a safer space is just to take out some doors and put some doors down and let's just put them down here What I would like to do is to kill Ender Guardian with my... Uh, well, actually, it doesn't make any difference in thinking about it. I'll kill it. Because it makes it a bit difficult with night vision going out here. I can't move, that's the only trouble. I'm stuck behind pillars. Get off two shots before they can actually get to me. That's pretty good, isn't it? So they're not being too difficult, these guardians. <clears throat> All right, this time I got him with a just a one arrow shot. So I've got the third one. What's that? Pack dice. That's interesting. Okay. I shall go and find the third one. I'll see you in a while. Something I've not seen before. Elder Prismarine. That's interesting. It's got holes in it. That's also unusual. I don't, I've never been to an ocean monument with that's got broken bits in it before. Never mind. Anyway, I'll be back in a minute. Here's the third one. Let's just try the axe on him. Oops. We've got to be a bit careful though. That's with looting. Moved away. So, all three. This monument has been basically dealt with. <laughs> Fish. With actually very little damage from my point of view. So I'm just going to get out, and I'll see, in a, I'll see you in a short while. Right, I'm out of the monument, but I'm curious about a few things. It's dark, I can't see. What I'd like to do is have a quick sleep. Let's, I think we can sleep on this. Let's look, I think this is packed ice. And I don't know whether I can break packed ice with uh, an axe. Because if I could, then I could take some packed ice back with me. Um, and I think I might have left the axe, the pack, the axe back in the other place anyway. I'll just go and see if I can get onto this thing. Let's swim on it. Because I think I'm far enough away from the, from the mobs now. Anyway, I'll see, you in, I'll see you in a short while when it's daytime. Well, sometimes you lose. There's lightning over there. Strange, I don't see anything for lightning. But I can see a boat. I can see a shipwreck. Let's go and have a look, investigate that thing. 
and I also think around here these look like I think buildings where you find downed mobs it's taking me a bit of a long time to get to this boat actually I'll probably just to swim see now my night vision's gone uh, let's just take this off and put it back on again and get a night vision strange so here we've got a shipwreck and in shipwrecks there are normally chests so let's have a look if we can find any there's one what's that got some gunpowder bamboo and suspicious stew i don't care about suspicious stew or the gunpowder let's have a look oh, what else have we got around here Another chest here, a compass, oh, a treasure, buried treasure map. Now that's probably worth investigating. And a compass maybe as well. Mm, I don't want to fill up my inventory completely, but I'll take, tell you what I'll do. Let's just move that off of my hand here. Let's just put down a shulker box and put some stuff away in there because at the moment it's, my inventory is a bit on the full side. Thank you. Oh, oh wrong one. <laughs> So what can we get? Prismarine, we can get rid of that. Prismarine shards, we can get rid of that. Prismarine crystals, great. Sponges, 20, 31. Bamboo, we don't need that. It's basically, we need the arrow, of course. Treasure map, we'll keep that with us. That we don't need. We don't need any more milk, anyway. And buckets. I think that'll do. We don't need the paper. Don't need the fish. What else is in here? I think that'll do. So let's uh, break this up. Pick it up again. Uh, probably I can break this chest now, thinking about it. Let's do that as well. I'm having difficulty breaking this chest. Tell you what, let's use this axe, because the Neptunian axe is, of course, is a water based thing. Is that any faster? Mm, not on Julie, is it? Mm. I am on the ground. <laughs> now, are there more than two chests in this um, ship? I don't know, to be honest with you. I think there are sometimes. But I'm not 100% sure. They are cool. So let's have a quick wander about this place, see if there's anything else of any interest. Shoals of fish. Mm, I always wanted to investigate this building over here, didn't I? I need some s seagrass. Yes, I want some seagrass. Whoa, does that not. Do I have to use shears for that? Ooh. Have I got any shears? I might have some shears with me actually. But they won't be in that one, will they? They might be in the white one. Because I this is one of the things that's useful to take with you, yes indeed. So we should be able to shear this. Now why do you want this? Is because with seagrass you can make sushi and sushi is one of the f foods that you get from aquaria whatever it's called culture I'll take this as well now what have we found here now that has an effect oh yes that's magna cream blocks pulls you down doesn't it oh chest that's interesting. I can't get to the chest. I've got to break it. Um, let's take this. It's not the most efficient tool. Did I not pick up those items? If I didn't. Oh, so what have we picked up this time? Coal? Ah, I haven't got my fishing rod in my offhand. Ah. Okay, that's bad. If I did don't have my magnetic this has got a magnet in it three let's look let's look they should pick up the items where 
are they all gone to? There we are, what have we just picked up? Oh, I've got a helmet. Some rotting flesh cool doors, yes, okay. Let's just sort that. Okay. Now, let's have a wander about a bit further. I have to call it a day fairly soon. Oh, another chest. Hopefully we can open this one. Yes, we can. Good. So we get another treasure map. That's great. Some more coal. Uh, a stone axe. Don't care about that. Some rotting flesh. And a fish. <laughs> Atlantic herring. Where did that come from? Did I get... I got some seagraph, but I didn't get any of this... Um, kelp. Do. Let's take the shears, we're going to get some more seagrass. I don't know whether you can actually grow seagrass, we'll try it. If not, I'll just make sure we've got plenty here. Now, where are we? Oh yes, look at this. The stuff's all coming to me. Oh, I need it in this pan, don't I? Of course, yes. Now, are the So we found two chests here. Oh, and there's another one, look. So what we got here, look at the C3 fishing rod, brilliant, that's a good one that one. And the rest is coal and that, we can leave that into there. So, are there any mob, more mobs around here? Oh, another one. We got the stem and emerald, oh, that's not too bad. Coal, wheat, I'll take the coal. And the emerald. Never too bad to have an extra emerald, is it really? Let's put the emerald up here where it belongs. Kelp, and we'll get rid of the seagrass in here as well. Get rid of these into the other bag, but I think my inventory is looking a bit on the full side. Put the clock. Right, I'm messing around a bit now, I don't mean to do so. <clears throat> Let's get rid of as much stuff in there as we can. So I'll be, I'll be on this, here we are. I knew there were some mobs around here, which what I've been looking for. What's this? Is this a downed? Eh, it looks like it, doesn't it? Let's, see, let's get my bow ready. Oh, one shot is done. Gone, okay. Did he drop? I don't think he dropped the helmet, probably that. Let's sort the inventory here. Anything new comes into those four slots. Here's a big underwater cavern. Hmm. So, I'll have a quick look around here and I'll come back if there's anything interesting. Well, I've got the treasure map. I'm actually just beside it, but what's this? This looks like half a ship. Or an upside down ship. Oh, indeed it is, isn't it? Now, does that mean in here there's some more chests? Ah, oh, yes, there are. Look. Oh, what have we got in here? Some more suspicious stew, paper, coal. Take it all with us. So there should be two. But there's some buried treasure around here. Um, there we go. There's a second one. Another map, buried treasure map. Unknown map, buried treasure. A book, a feather, and some paper. Okay, that it doesn't mean my inventory is getting into a really bad state, of course. But, having said that, we have got our bags here. And we can shift click anything in that's in here already and also in here we can get rid of anything that's already there that was paper wasn't there and that makes life a little bit easy we've got five slots there so there was an unburied treasure map that's is it the same one it is indeed the same one i think i've got the same one three times now so I've got one in my offhand here, which is this one, and this one's the same one. That's a bit, that's a bit boring, isn't it? <laughs> and it's just over here. So I'm going to see if I can find it. Looks like it's here, huh? Where is it exactly? Was it exactly under this block here? All right, I shall dig around and see if I find anything. I'll see you in a short while. That was easy. One or excavate. And I found this. Oh. Oh, I've got what I need, the heart of the sea. Fantastic. Diamonds, gold, the work. Emeralds, prismarine shards. TNT, hopefully it wasn't a trapped chest. 
So I need to break it, basically get make enough space for this. Um, I think I'm going to go up here. Well, oh, skeleton. He doesn't see me yet. Let's get this bow going on him. Ah, I've put my arrows away. Fact. I could probably sleep here as it happens. Uh, but I won't. I'll just get the... Where's the arrows gone to? I'll use this bow instead. So I can hear you. Maybe. There we are. Oop, missed. First time. Right, so let's get this treasure. Oh, I know what I wanted to do. I wanted to put up here the um, shulker boxes because the shulker boxes are easy to mine up when they're on the surface, of course. Let's get that one and will that be enough? Probably be enough as it happens. Let's put the sand into there. Don't want the feather, that one. Don't really want the fish. Don't want the doors. Don't want the identical tier, um, treasure maps twice. That's three times as it happens. Uh, I don't need that. Don't need suspicious stew. Basically, it's not very good, suspicious stew. It will hurt. Now, have I got enough space for everything in here? Yes, of course, because I. Indeed, I have. Fantastic. So let's put all of this stuff in here like that. Um, possibly not everything. We don't need the clock with this. I'll tell you what. I can now break this with my pickaxe. If I can find my pickaxe. If I can't find it because I've just put it away in here. Very smart. Actually, I've also put the arrows away, but I'll worry about those another time. Let's dig that up and let's go home. In fact, while I'm here, Yes, I'll go home. So here we come. Back to base with a load of loot. So next time, we are going to build that enchanting thing from Apotheosis and see how it, what that does. So until next time, I wish you all the best. Bye for now.